My name is McScartley and I am the District Coordinator of Libraries and Instructional Technology here for Scarborough Public Schools. And I'm gonna be helping out Ms. Dupree with some of her projects over the next couple months or so. And so today I am doing this tutorial on how to use the library um, catalog to find books or to make requests. So here from the Scarborough High School webpage, in the upper right hand corner, we have the Learning Commons link. It will open in a new tab and we have all these different options. But for today, we want to look at the upper left corner. It's the library catalog called Fall at Destiny. A lot of times librarians will just call this Destiny for short. And it brings you to this search page. And there's lots of different options here, but you've probably seen a search bar like this before. You can search by keyword, the title of the book, the author, those sorts of things. Now you can search for a book without doing anything else just to see if it's available in the library. If you log in, you do get a, a few more options which can be helpful. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like. So I have borrowed the identity of a former student. I didn't steal it, I'm just borrowing it. So students log in with their school email address and their student number or their lunch number. And if you have trouble logging in, be sure to check in with the folks in the library because that's typically should be a pretty easy fix. So now that I'm logged in, there's this home page. So to do my search, I go back to catalog and I can also have this tab called my info where I could see um, books I have checked out or things I've requested, things like that. So I'm going to go back to the catalog and by default, this should be actually on Scarborough High School. So you're only searching books that are available at Scarborough High School. So I'm going to search for an author I like named Jeff Vandermeer. And this is telling me that I didn't find anything. And the reason why is because I spelled his name wrong. So unlike services like Google in Destiny, you have to be careful of spelling. Uh, sometimes it will give you a suggestion. So it's asking if I meant Jeff Vandermeer. So I'm going to try that. And there it is. So again, spelling counts. If you miss, if you don't get any results, check your spelling. So now I can see this is the book that's available in the library. Here's the call number. So I could just go into the library, check that out, uh, find it on the shelf and check it out. Or the other thing I can do is I can click on the title and it will give me some more information. And one of the options that is available here is in this upper right corner, I can click hold it. And it's telling me that I have requested this book and I need to pick it up before October 15th. And what this does is on the librarian's end, they will see I've requested this book. So they'll pull it off the shelf for me and they'll hang on to it until I can come pick it up and check it out in the library. So that can be a pretty handy tool as well. Similarly, if I go back to the catalog and let's say I'm doing a project on like a children's book author. I wanna search the whole district. So here I'm gonna search for frog and toad, classic children's stories. And so here I have frog and toad together. And over here I see no local copy, so we don't have it at the high school, but there is one copy at one of the other schools. So I would click here and the same thing, I would click hold it and then that would end up that would be sent to the high school so I could check it out. Um, the last thing I will show you very quickly is there's this basic search, which you'll probably use most of the time. There is also this option for a visual search or uh, maybe browse is more appropriate. So I could look at the Prince Award and the Prince Award is given to outstanding young adult literature. So these are all the books in the library that have won or been nominated for that award. So then I can just sort of browse to see what books are available that have won that award. So that's the basics of how to use Destiny, our library catalog. If you have trouble or questions, be sure to reach out um, to the library staff and we'll be happy to help you out.